Hello, Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome, cross watchers. I hope you're all having an amazing day today. I'm going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you all. What's going on right now in your current situation with you? person on your mind if any and what you need to know so whenever you do see this it will be the right time as always take what resonates and leave out the rest practice using your own discernment and don't forget to like comment and subscribe follow me on all social media tiktok instagram I am spiritually goldie on all platforms. Okay, finances is coming up for you. Two of pentacles, things are getting busy or you're like in a busy season or that's that could be happening in the next two weeks. We have a three of pentacles at the bottom. So you are, I feel like you're in the beginning stages of working on something or building something in your life right now where there's others involved. And it's, you may feel like you have a lot on your plate at this moment. I'm getting the energy of you having a lot going on on your plate. And you're like super, I'm, I'm hearing tunnel vision. Tunnel vision on your goals. Some of you may be asked to focus on your finances or your career right now. I'll clarify this two of pentacles. Three of pentacles came out again. Yeah, so definitely you're, you're building something, but I, I see you like, I see you feeling kind of not so confident right now about what's about whether or not this is going to turn into a sense of security or financial stability okay you may feel like you're maybe struggling like finances are tight right now and you some of you may be feeling like you're lacking something in some way here and this could be the reason why they're saying to focus more on this um, if you're not already, but they're saying change is coming. Okay. Something in your, in regards to your financial situation is about to change. It's about to transform. And the way that I'm seeing this is like you are in a cocoon ready to be a butterfly, ready for growth. And you're in this like discomfort. Okay. So even though things don't feel good right now, or things feel uncomfortable right now, there, this is going to change. This is only temporary is what they're saying. Okay. Um, but yeah, it feels like you may have a lot going on at this moment. Some of you, there's a situation where you feel like there may be silence between you and another person, ghosted, and you may feel like you miss them or some of you feel like maybe a little bit guilty that you are prioritizing certain things aside from this person right now. Okay, King of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Doesn't have to be though. Uh, but this is someone who cares about you a whole, a whole lot. And for some reason... I'm seeing you feeling guilty for something right now. Like there's some level of, of like guilt. Hmm. Nine of Wands feels like you've been fighting for something for a long time or you feel like you are being pushed to your limits right now. And it's exhausting. Clarify this nine of wands. Yeah, you're like, is anything ever going to change? I'm hearing, will things ever change for me? Okay. Ooh. Okay. 
yeah, some of you are maybe uh, like feeling as if something has control or power over you right now. It could be a job situation. It could be something that you've been investing your time, your energy towards. And you're like, oh gosh, like, is this ever going to change? Hmm. I see you reconsidering something. Like releasing yourself or getting out of a situation, taking time to maybe distance. Some of you, it's you where you're distancing yourself from things and people right now in isolation, taking some time to, you know, be alone for a little bit to really think about certain decisions that you've made and think about in what way you can like bring your power back to yourself and, and looking for signs, looking for some some clarity in that isolation. Something's happening for you in isolation here that feels like it's creating a, a, ch a massive change in your life, okay? It's like temporary discomfort or temporary... Um, like I'm picking up something about like this this unease is temporary and i'm picking up like lost sight so some of you maybe you feel like you're kind of losing sight of that and you're coming back to remembering what your what it is that why you started this in the first place or why you did something in the first place coming back to your why about this knight of pentacles reversed okay oh someone is is like heartbroken over the fact that you've you're you're prioritizing other things or you're not giving this person a lot of attention or time right now and or things are just out of stalemate, and this person is like really torn apart for, because of that. Okay, what is this text message about? Memories. Someone's gonna message you. This could be a text, a call, email, a phone call. Like someone is like bringing up memories. Like, it's going to be like, hey, like, do you remember, like, when we did this? Or it's almost like someone's reminiscing, like, the good times. Or they're thinking about the good times that you two have had. And they're bringing it up to you through a message. Maybe they're sending you, like, pictures or something. Yeah, some of you are going to get a message from someone who you have memories with. Okay, two of cups reversed. Yeah, I feel like you're hurting over the fact that like you're disconnected from someone right now or there's been a disconnect emotionally or you're hurting over the fact that you just can't uh, prioritize um, someone who you really care about right now. King of Pentacles. Mm, you have big goals, don't you? I feel like you're in this King of Pentacles. It's like you know what has to be done for you to be in a stable and secure position in your life. And it's not and not everyone's going to understand. And I feel like you have intentions towards making bigger commitments or prioritizing a connection that you have with someone. Moving something forward. It's like you're saying, no, I want to move things forward here and have some sort of re-spark. 
clarify the magician reverse, but at the same time, you're feeling as if someone's manipulating things. Hmm. Oh, wow. Yeah, some of you feel like someone's like manipulating things in a way it's like they're trying to make you feel guilty. Or you feel like they're using their own power in a way that is like destructive. Because I feel like this, you know, or this person knows that you have feelings or emotions for them or you care about them very deeply. And you feel like you're like, just because I have these feelings or just because I love you or I care about you, like, doesn't mean that you can use that power it over me. Just because you're not getting from something right, getting some, something from me right now. Hmm. If you have someone in mind, think of that about them. Power of search for us, okay. Yeah, there's something that they're just like not letting go of. They're not healing from this tower. They're in they're in shock over something, or they feel like things have suddenly changed here. Like things have become more karmic between the both of you. All of a sudden, really quickly, unexpectedly. Huh. Wow. It's interesting because I feel like this person knows how you're feeling right now. Three of Swords. They know that your I mean five of cups in your energy them looking at you as a three of swords it's like they're aware that something's hurting you the ones they are gonna take action towards you pretty suddenly this could be travel it could be again communication there's there's something here that I, I see this person as trying to like dismantle clarify the tower their intentions surprise okay Hmm. I feel like this person is like, in a way, going to surprise you. Suddenly, it, I just feel like there's uh, all of a sudden you're getting communication from this person and it's like them communicating like... I'm seeing 88, them communicating like either, either, I'm hearing like yes or no. They're like, is it a yes or is it a no? Like kind of like an ultimatum. Either we do this now or I need to walk away. Hmm. And I see you being like, to be honest, I cannot give you what you need. Where by this Queen of Swords? I see you detaching from this person. Yeah, you're detaching from this person. Um, I feel like you're moving towards a new beginning that is going to be more passionate or you're prioritizing your finances right now. I'm hearing promotion. Some of you are about to receive a promotion here or you're getting more stable financially with this four of pentacles. I feel like you're pushing this person away. Because, like, I'm here, I'm like, the more you think about things, 
you see how she's just thinking like I see some of you are like the more I think about this the more I'm starting to realize like this person is um like it's almost like they're using something against you or using your own emotions against you hmm <clears throat> I feel like you honestly get over this pretty quickly though this person or this situation tell me more about this change tell me more about this change coming in for Gemini runner within a few weeks distance some of you yeah you're distancing yourself creating distance between you and another person right now creating a change in your life because I see you realizing like if you don't make a change or you you don't take back your power in a situation nothing's gonna change You're taking a chance here. You're like, I don't know what's going to happen here. I don't know if I'm going to regret this. But I know that I need to just take a chance on myself. Focus on myself here. I need to create a positive shift. I need to create a positive change. Change is coming because you're creating this change. Because you're starting to look at things more realistically here. When it comes to a decision that you can maintain or balance. It's like you're you're in this ebb and flow right now of like, what can I keep and what do I have to let go of? I'm seeing the number is 952. Those numbers, they could be birthday, special day, synchronicities. I'm seeing the letters T, M, K, R, H, G, C, F. Those letters could be in your name or someone else's name. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have an amazing and blessed rest of your day. Bye.